How's it going watchers? Next episode of Full Metal Alchemist Brotherhood. Yes, I'm aware I am wearing a tank top. It is hot. If I wear anything else, I'll just bake and I'll just have to take my top off during video, which I don't want to do. So I'd rather wear a tank top and look like a gay biker because that was what I was called the last time I was wearing this. So without further ado, let's watch Full Metal Alchemist Brotherhood. I don't like you one bit. I don't like you. Not as much as Tompa. Tompa's a prick. So I like him more than him, so that's saying something. I forgot about you. He's been trying to make you do stuff, eh? They want to open that door thing, don't they? That's what they were talking about before. So either way, everyone's someone's going to die. Of all the homunculuses, that one's the prickest of them all, but partially like him. Just partially. Who the hell's that? Is that Lust talking to him from another dimension or something? You're losing it. You're talking to a butterfly. ロスタンの大佐に<笑> He's already broken out pretty much, hasn't he? And guns ain't gonna do nothing against him. You are lucky you stopped. Good reflexes. Does that mean they can all do something like that? Poor panda. Don't throw him. I'm 
I don't think even that's going to be enough. That is definitely not going to be enough. Gonna eat the flames. Oh, hello, Natsu. Be in the fire now. There's a point though, because I mean, we haven't really seen Ed and Al actually manage to hold their own against the homunculus just yet. Oh, nicely done. I can't really think of a way to beat him unless they... You can't necessarily bury him because he'll just eat his way out. I mean, another human could, just, could probably kill him. Just put heavy metal on him, make him sink in the ocean. I really don't know how he can beat Gluttony. Substitution. Yeah, enough chit chat. Move it, move it. Why is the panda staying behind? I'm sure that can fit in the car. Oh, that, that's... That's useless. It's useless. Don't take it. Don't you take it. You don't want it. Are you actually going to take it? Alright, considering he's, he's going to use it, obviously it's going to have some sort of beneficial meaning for it. I personally can't imagine him shooting anyone with it, let alone killing anyone with it, even a homunculus won't do anything. I'm just going to aim for its eyeball, try and pop it. He's really pissed. Yeah. Oh, right, it's you. Oh, that explains it. Okay. Ooh. 
on you guys. some point during the story he's probably going to kill his own well it's not he's adopted granted but i think he's going to kill his child i get the feeling it sickens him hearing stuff like this Oh, you got him, and he got you. Hurt him. I mean, Gluttony's been through worse, and he gets straight back up. Oh, bye bye. Or not. Cheap. You always fall for cheap tricks. Ooh. Someone got hit in that. Someone definitely got hit in that. Fire to your end. Okay. What about the other two? You're, you're just... I half expected them to be on the other side of that wall, but I guess not. 
Does that mean Pride's dead? Unless he's just like uh, reformed himself inside of Gluttony. Everyone just keeps going out when they're wounded, don't they? I get the feeling like uh, Bradley can just turn the entire alchemist group onto these guys. Because it is the higher command, I mean, they're, not gonna, they're probably not even going to believe these guys. They have to have proof. You want to talk? Everyone in this anime is pretty much stubborn. さて、ご挨拶に回らず。兄貴、こんな夜にもし明けられません。構わんよ。時に裏番の狸獅子は元気かね。相変わらずです。チェック。参りました。これで順次の倍だ。12だよ。まあ、今回はなかなか検討したが
ってさっきのジョークあー大曹操がホモンクルスだとか続けたまえどうしたねボスタンの大曹Yeah, yeah. This is exactly what I was saying when I was in the car. Have it watches. I'm going to assume that Pride is still going to be alive, all things considering what happened to Lust. Like, she was literally burnt to a crisp and she kept getting back up. Literally, the sapphire ripped out of her, or Flossa Stone, sorry, ripped out of her chest. Still regenerates, and all that happened there is that she got sucked in her waist up into gluttony. So, I'm going to assume she's, or he, sorry, is still going to be alive and going to be inside gluttony along with um, Ed. As for their friend, I really don't know if he's still going to be alive. Uh, he should have been sucked in whole because there's no body parts left, so he should also be fine. I'm hoping, anyway. But yeah, I, like I was saying when I was in the car, that I reckon that Bradley's got all well, the higher ups and just the military wrapped around his、uh, finger because him himself is the higher commander, so they're also going to listen to him regardless of what anyone else says that are below him. So yeah, Mustang's screwed, pretty much. Everyone's screwed. The army's just. Corrupt, which I've been saying this entire time. I've been saying that I, I think that the、uh, armies, or the alchemists, are all corrupt. There's just a select few of them that are decent, but they're just taking orders obviously from the higher ups, which are the ones that are corrupt. So now I've got to wait till the next episode to find out what's going to happen and whether or not the others are still alive inside Gluttony's tummy tum. So, like always, watchers, thanks for watching, and I'll see you all next time. <laughs>